from Starship Media here, and we are here with Chris. Okay, so, oh, okay, so we've heard you've been in the studio. What have you been working on? Um, well, the past month we've been doing like we've been recording basically an album. We have eight songs done so far, and then we're going in to do the last couple of songs uh, in the next month. And it's we just got one of the first mixes, so it sounds really good so far. And we're happy with it. So yeah, new music coming. So how is uh, this new album that you're recording now different from your old EP? Um, well, it's definitely. I mean, it's different in a lot of ways. Uh, sonically. Like, we went for a different approach to how we recorded it, just because the first, we were happy with the EP, but it sounded so, well, first of all, there's three people in the band, and we did that, and now there's two guitar players, so there's that element, and then things like that. And then, uh, song-wise, uh, it's definitely progressed in the sense that, you know, we listen to all sorts of different kind of music now, and so it's definitely, uh, I mean, it's... It's, I'm not really sure how to say it, but like all the songs are really different from each other, yet they all stay in the same style. So it's definitely, it's definitely something fun listening to. Now you said you have other bandmates. Who are they? Um, well, uh, I play guitar and sing, and then Skylar Leon plays guitar. Gavin Bennett plays bass and does uh, vocals too. And then we have a drummer, Miles Kotak. Okay, so how have uh, things changed for you differently from like um, Bamboo and Oh Yeah. Oh yeah, well Bamboo. I was playing with uh, my old band, and uh, so I'm trying to think what to say. <laughs> okay. Well, when uh, I talked to you at Bamboozle, we had I was I was playing in another band at the time. I was playing bass, and then that kind of helped me. It was kind of like a launch pad. Do a bunch of new things. I I met my drummer through that band, the drummer we have now, and uh, a lot of things like that. So a lot of things have changed. Now I started this doing this band for the past year now. And, uh, you know. Can you stand down? Please. Uh, yeah, please. And, okay. <laughs> now, if you could choose anybody past or present, who would it be? And why? Um, that's hard. There's a lot of bands I like to tour with. Uh, I'd say the ultimate thing, what well, really depends, like, as far as, like, big bands go, I don't know, I think it'd be fun to tour with, like, let me think about this. <laughs> I get asked this question every time, but I never have a set answer. Alright, I'll try again. Alright, uh, we were trying to like, kind of say hmm, Well, let's see. Touring, uh, probably bands like, um... Alright, <laughs> I still have nothing. You know, like, uh, uh, Fall Out Boy, you know? Uh, I think, they, I think they broke up. Did they really? That's what I heard. Uh, oh, crap, I didn't know that. Okay. That sucks. But uh, I think they like half broke up. <laughs> yeah, um, oh. like two guys like quit the band. Or I don't know. But uh, bands I love to tour with. I mean, it goes from really any band that we'd love to tour with. I mean, we all listen to bands like Green Day, and then there's bands like Gallows, and uh, they're more of like an underground band and stuff like that. And uh, I don't know, I'm really into this band right now called The Almost, which is like the drummer, the little drummer from Under Oath, this band. And uh, I don't know, we're just any band really, we just want to tour, we just want to start touring as soon as we can. Very cool. So how do you describe your musical style? Our musical style, it's very, it's very rock driven and there's a lot of punk influences too from bands like I was saying, like Gallows, like more underground stuff. And then bands like The Misfits and, but our sound is really, I mean, it's hard to compare it to anything else, at least for me, because you know, I'm coming at it with a different ear than everybody else because, you know, writing the music and stuff, it's hard to say, but I don't know, it's definitely, it's really hard hitting, it's uh, but at the same time, it's, I don't know, you really, <laughs> wow. you have to hear it for yourself. <laughs> Alright, now, um, okay, so you might know music, correct? Yeah, totally. So what comes first, the music, or like the lyrics, the, the melody, the title, what, what comes first for you? Um, for me, it all comes, I, I usually have a guitar or something and I'll play a riff and then it all comes from there. And then, then comes like the music and stuff, and then I do the, the drums and the bass, whatever, and then the lyrics, and then we all learn the rest of the Okay, cool. Okay. So if you could say one thing to your fans right now, what would it be? Um, hey, how's it going? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> uh, thank you for your support, and uh... Okay! <laughs> yeah, there you go. Okay. Alright, now could you do a quick shout out to Social Media? Quick shout out to Starstruck Media. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. <laughs>